Welcome to Geek Watch. This is Incarnations. For this episode, we talk about all five official big screen incarnations of Superman. But before we start, please consider hitting subscribe and be part of Geek Watch's quest for the YouTube silver play button. Let's start. Number 1. Kirk Allen was an American vaudeville singer and dancer, a feature film actor who mostly had bit parts before obtaining the role of Superman. As Superman he appeared in two 15-chapter movie serials, the first one entitled Superman, 1948, and Atom Man vs. Superman, 1950. We get to see Allen back in his Superman costume when he played with other celebrities in a charity baseball game as seen in this reel from Paramount News. Superman is not the only DC character Allen played, in 1952 he played the titular character of Black Hawk in another movie serial. Kirk Allen returned to the world of Superman when he had a very brief cameo as Sam Lane in the 1978 Superman the movie. You can't defy the world and get away with it, Luthor. Number 2. George Reeves was an American actor whose film career began with the classic movie Gone with the Wind, it will be more than a decade after that film before he suits up as Superman. He first appeared as Superman in the 1951 movie Superman and the Mole Men, the first feature-length film for the character. Reeves will then transition the character to television in The Adventures of Superman which ran for six seasons from 1952 to 1958. In the third season, we see the series shift from black and white to color film. In 1954 Reeves made the short film Stamp Day for Superman, in which the character was promoting the purchase of US saving bonds. Reeves also appeared in character in a 1957 episode of I Love Lucy. George Reeves has played several characters throughout his film career. He is best remembered as Superman. <laughs> oh, golly Superman, am I glad to see Number you. Number 3. Christopher Reeve was an American actor, director, and activist. Reeves' only film credit before landing the role of Superman was the 1978 Grey Lady Down. Reeve appeared as Superman in four feature-length movies, Superman the Movie, 1978, Superman II, 1980, Superman III, 1983, and Superman IV, The Quest for Peace, 1987. Christopher Reeve appeared in several films and TV shows but no role was as successful as his role as Superman. In 2003 Reeve would return to the world of Superman when he appeared as Dr. Virgil Swan in a couple of episodes of Smallville. His character gave a young Clark Kent information about where he comes from and how to use his powers for the good of mankind. I believe this is your floor. Number 4. Brandon Routh is an American actor whose early film career includes being an extra in Christina Aguilera's music video. As party guy at concert in TV's Gilmore Girls. Then getting steady work on the One Life to Live soap opera. And finally inheriting the mantle of Superman from Christopher Reeve. Routh's Superman appeared in one feature-length film, the 2006's Superman Returns movie. Routh's Superman is hinted to be a continuation of Reeves' Superman. Though he never returned to the big screen as Superman, Routh was able to play a version of the character in the CW vs. Crisis on Infinite Earth, this one inspired by the Kingdom Come version in the comics. Superman is not the only DC character Routh has brought to life, in the CW vs. shows he played Ray Palmer, the shrinking superhero known as the Atom. Number 5. Henry Cavill is a British actor whose first film appearance was in 2001's Laguna, it would be 12 more years before he stars in a film as Superman. Cavill would appear as Superman in three movies, 2013 Man of Steel, 2016 Batman v Superman, Dawn of Justice, and both version of the Justice League movie, 2017 theatrical release and 2021 Zack Snyder's Justice League. Body doubles wearing Cavill's Superman costume appeared in the Shazam movie, and the Peacemaker TV series. Outside of Superman, one of Henry Cavill's most notable roles is Geralt of Rivia, star of the Witcher series. It is fun to note that Cavill could have been Superman earlier with 2004's Superman Flyby, 
but that film eventually morphed into 2006's Superman Returns with Brandon Routh playing Superman. In my world, it means hope. That's it for this episode. Don't forget to subscribe, click the notification bell, leave a comment, and share the video. You can find Geekwatch in Facebook, Twitter and Instagram. Then head out to our merch store, link is in the description below.